welcome to my YouTube channel, Sarah's View. Today, I'm going to review all the books I read this week. First, I read Mermaid Rocks, The Midnight Run. In this book, Naya, this mermaid over here, and her friends explore the midnight realm because they need more data for their project. In their project, they have a prize. The, f the best project gets the first spot in their sightseeing trip. But Naya and her friends get in lots of problems. And with Naya and the other's help, and some other creature's help, they will escape it. That's what this book is about. I recommend this book for people who like sea adventures. Next, I read Rikabapsita, Alamas, Iguanas, and my very best friend. In this book, Rika thinks that her best friend Ilani is moving to Florida forever. But it, in the end, it, it looks like Ilani and Rika are just going to go for a Florida trip. How fun is that? But Rika wants to save up lots of money to buy an extraordinary pet to replace an extraordinary friend. So she saves up and Ilani thinks, doesn't know that she's moving. At least Rika thinks that she's moving. And she decides to give all her pocket money savings to Rika to buy a pet. She says that it's fair because she will come to Rika's house to touch the pet and comb and have some fun together. So I recommend this book for people who want to know how to save money and how Rika goes through it. Next, I read Molly Moon's Incredible Book of Hypnotism. In this book, Molly is a poor orphan in a horrible orphanage. But she finds a mysterious old book about hypnotism by the best hypnotist in the world. She takes it to her horrible orphanage and hyp hypnotizes lots of people and gets to the top. So, but there's a stranger looking at Molly, feeling very jealous. He would do anything to get her hypnotist secret. This book is very interesting. I recommend this book to people who like hypnotism and want to find out how Molly got in top. Next, I read Inside Out, Driven by Emotions. In this book, really an 11 year old gets controlled by five emotions. Joy, fear, disgust, anger, and sadness. The five emotions. So, really moves to San Francisco, and all the emotions finds it horrible. But Joy thinks it's okay since she's happiness. So Joy and Sadness get sucked up in a tube and they have a different adventure. But Fear, Disgust and Anger stay and try to control Riley's mind without Joy and Sadness help. And that turns into a disaster. All her personality islands are breaking down. So this book, all five emotions tell the same story of Riley moving to Francisco in their own way. I recommend this book for people who want to know more about emotions and what really did. Thank you for watching. If you find this useful, please subscribe to my channel. Bye.